Hey, this is Jason with Revan Optics. Um, today we have a pretty cool product here. It's uh, Snap, uh, formerly Snapchat Spectacles. Uh, a good friend of ours sent his pair over. We're gonna make some uh, prescription replacement lenses for his pair here. But before we do that, um, he let us just kind of take a look at them and we wanted to unbox them for you. So um, as probably most of you know, uh, these are dispensed from vending machines around the country. So Snap's uh, distribution has been basically to drop vending machines all over the country and then people stand in line and there's a camera on the front. You can see yourself in the Snap shades before you actually purchase them. So there's kind of a virtual try on experience. Uh, if you decide to purchase them, I think all of them are $130 now. Put your money in, this drops out of the vending machine. Uh, it's kind of like a tennis ball canister almost. Um, and you can see a picture of the shades on the front there. It says spectacles. And then on the back here, um, it has the made for iPhone uh, Snap logo just for Snapchat um, and some other information here um, about uh, the logo and then made in China right down here. So what's inside? Spectacles, charging case, and charging cable. Uh, and then it has the Bluetooth logo, looks like the Android logo there as well. So we'll go ahead and open these up now. Uh, it even has the Snapchat eye on the top here and this tennis ball case again kind of feel to the top here. Um, so if you come on around, um, here's the top of the case. You can kind of see it has the same cutout as the case itself. So if it basically holds it in place uh, snugly there within the container. And then go ahead and pull this out. Um, nice looking case here. Um, kind of a cool texture, almost feels like the dashboard of a car, kind of a soft touch feel. And then uh, speckled here with uh, black, so a lot of the black and yellow theme throughout here. Um, and then cool little feature here too, or a little, I guess, um, icon in the form of a nylon tab is the, again the Snapchat eye. And then uh, here's what looks to be kind of a charging area for the case. So the case itself is a battery and then you can charge it with a cable. You plug the cable in there and then plug that into the wall. Um, unfortunately, we didn't get the cable with this pair, but um, we did get the shades. I'm gonna open them right side up here. So here they are. As you can see, they're charging. Looks like the LED is this LED ring here, which is on the wearer's left side, is uh, pulsing up and down there, indicating that it is charging. So uh, the camera here is on the, the wearer's right side. You can kind of see that there. Um, and then you can get a little detailed shot of the LEDs, really tiny LEDs there glowing as a ring. Um, and then if you're getting close here too, you can see the contacts. So here on this side is where it meets the uh, kind of interior of the frame there. Those are where the contacts are made and it's magnetic. So you can hear kind of a snapping noise when it connects and it holds it in place there. So I'm not gonna try not to dip these out, but see it holds it in place, uses magnets. And then the right side is purely just a magnet co to connect here again to hold it in place. So um, this side uh, holds all the camera equipment and then this side holds the battery and then there's a button there. If you press that, um, that'll start recording. And then there's a wire. We saw one of these cut open. There's a wire that runs through the frame connecting the two as well, a copper wire there. As far as the frames go, they're actually really sturdy. So I'm impressed by these. Um, they're, it feels like they're made of acetate, and then they have, uh, you can kind of see in this pair in particular, it's kind of a smoky um, acetate, so you have some um, black like details in there that looks like smoke, and then a metal kind of frame piece integrated into the acetate. That just makes it sturdier. Oops, I just hit the record button. So... Yeah, you see the blinking light there as it's recording which is pretty cool. Um, and then you have two nose pads here and here. Again, kind of that soft touch as it's resting on your nose. Um, and then these look like three barrel hinges or two barrel metal hinges there. Again, these are made in China. They actually kind of look like they're made in Italy, just the fashion side and then the quality of the materials themselves. Um, on your face, they're supposed to be a unisex design. So they, they kind of have that feel. They look funny on my head because I have a bigger head, but they, they just fit right. They feel really good. We've had a few people try them on here in the office. Um, not a lot of pin pinching looks good on male and female faces for the most part. Uh, and, and yeah, it just feels evenly weighted, which is kind of shocking given that there's a lot of hardware in the front. 
So you can see the profile is nice and, and slender, but then when you rotate it up, you can see there really is a lot of hardware um, up here where the frame meets the, the temple. Um, that's where they're storing everything. But, but from an outsider's perspective, it really just looks like a fashionable frame. Obviously, you have these two big identifying circles here and here, and then the unique lens cut out as well. So overall, really well-made frame, pretty simple design. It says spectacles on the interior there. So you can catch that, kind of a silvery um, inlaid. I'm guessing that's a laser etch. Um, and then on this side here, it says design by Snap Inc. So again, they've, that's really light, but they've kind of dropped their um, Snapchat and gone with just Snap. And then down here, it looks like a SKU and the FCC ID. And looks like they just have made in China on this here, so they didn't put that on the frame. Um, so yeah, really cool frame, um, cool case. And then, uh, yeah, the case here is pretty lightweight. Um, feels like a, you know, just a solid case. Uh, again, they've integrated the battery in there so you can charge your shades when you're not using them. Um, really, really well designed, well done by Snapchat. Uh, if you do need any like RX lenses for these or you happen to scratch your lenses, uh, RevanOptics.com is the place to find lenses for them. Uh, we just started doing uh, prescription lenses and we should have non-prescription lenses very soon. So um, check that out. Thanks for watching the video and uh, let us know what you think of your snap shades or what you think of the video. Thanks.